In this lesson, we're going to talk about finding the integral of sine cube x dx. Now, what we need to do is we need to expand this expression. Sine cube is basically sine squared times sine x dx. Now, sine squared, using the Pythagorean identity, is 1 minus cosine squared. Now that expression comes from this equation. Sine squared plus cosine squared is equal to 1. So if you subtract both sides by cosine squared, you'll get that sine squared is 1 minus cosine squared. So this is what we now have. At this point, what we need to do is use u substitution to find the indefinite integral. So we're going to make u equal to cosine x, and du is going to be negative sine x dx, and solving for dx, that's going to be du divided by negative sine x. So let's replace cosine with the u variable, and let's replace dx with du divided by negative sine. So we have the integral of 1 minus u squared times sine x times du divided by negative sine x. And so we could cancel these two terms, but the negative sign, I'm going to move it to the front. So this is going to be negative integral 1 minus u squared du. Now the antiderivative of 1, that's going to be equal to u, and the antiderivative of u squared is u to the third over 3, plus some constant c. Now I'm going to distribute the negative sign, and, and then I'm going to like reverse the two variables. So it's going to be plus 1 third u to the third, and then minus u plus c. Now the last thing that we need to do is we need to replace u with cosine x. And so this will give us the final answer of 1 third cosine cubed minus cosine x plus c. And that's it. So that's the integral of sine to the third x power. 